Hello and welcome back to some retro FIFA 14. Previously, we have built the full Bundesliga team of the season. We have built the full BPL team of the season. Today, we are building the full Serie A team of the season. And I am going to go on a whim and say this is probably, maybe excluding one striker who, spoilers, it's a mobile and he's not particularly amazing. This could be the best team of the season yet. If you guys enjoy this video and want to see some more retro FIFA 14, I'm thinking we should do a video around five-star skill moves Ibrahimovic. So if you would like to see that, smash a like on this video. Can you guys get 5,000 likes in the first two hours? It's a big challenge, but I reckon you guys can do it, so go mental on that like button. And as well, if you want to go and get yourself any coins, the link down in the description is always to IG Sky. 100% reliable, and you can buy coins on FIFA 14 or 15, depending on which one you want to play. If you want to come back and do some retro stuff and just play some games with all these cool players like I have, because Team of the Season has been delayed, then you can go over there, get yourself some coins. And as always, the discount code AJ Free gets you 8% off. But you can see in goal, we have got to Sanctus. So I was pretty surprised to remember that there wasn't a Buffon Team of the Season. Team of the Season to Sanctus has got... Some stats better than normal Buffon and some stats worse than normal Buffon because they are the same rating. But he looks still like a pretty solid player and he's actually pretty cheap as team of the seasons go on this game. 360k is a little bit of a bargain. Centre back is where it gets crazy up first in the middle. We've got 91 rated Giorgio Chiellini. Next one, Benatia, so not at Bayern Munich yet. AS Roma, 90 rated Benatia with 79 pace, 94 defender, 92 heading is insane compare that to 81 pace 93 defender and 90 heading for Chiellini and then put next to them to finish this bad boy off only 84 rated and only 64 pace but he costs 290k and he's the best other centre back that you can get from the Syria there is no left back so you can't play four at the back which is really annoying there's a right back mic on which could probably play centre back and get away with if you really wanted to but I was going for full chemistry so we've got Castan who still looks like a pretty decent player and to be honest I think I'm gonna go like this Swap him around and put the slowest one in the middle. Starting things off at centre defensive mid, we have got Daniele De Rossi. Look at the stats on this fella. 89, 88, 83, 86, 79 and even 73 pace on De Rossi is pretty bloody good as well. But he is nothing compared to team of the season Vidal. Good lord. 78, 86, 89, 90, 89 shooting as well and 84 pace. They are some absolutely godly stats. Left midfield, we've got the sweat that is team of the season, Jovino with his 92 pace. And then the opposite side, we could have gone for team of the season, Quadrado, but I'm not much of a skiller and I didn't really like him on the old game. So I've gone instead for the sweat that is 93 pace, team of the season, Jose Callejon. Again, just look at the stats on them two boys. To be honest, the, the top one's the only one you want to look at. 93 pace and 92 pace is just godly. Central attack and mid to rival Vidal. We have got team of the season, Pogba. Which one of these guys has got the better stats? Look at that. Three wins to Vidal, two wins to Pogba, and one even on the passing. But just look at the both of them. It's just insanity. 80 pace, 88 shooting, 90 passing, 92 dribbling on Pogba for a camp. It's just godly. It's pretty expensive. I got him trade offered by some absolute legend who's lent me some players on this game. He's probably going to cost more than Vidal. I'd say he's probably about 4 million, which is stupid. Vidal cost me 3.2. But the stats on these two guys are just madness. Two of the most all-round players on this game. And their FIFA 15 team of the seasons are going to be insane as well. I think Vidal could be like almost 90 in every stat, which would just be nuts. He is in this one, of course, but he's over 80s already in his man of the match on FIFA 15. So his team of the season is just going to be mental. Same goes for Pogba. Striker then, we've got, like I said, a mobile. It was pretty poo, but they're actually pretty good on this game as well. You can see it says for some reason that I've already played games with them, which I haven't because I haven't got time to play 33 games of this guy and I've only just bought him. But you can see his record isn't too bad for an 82 rated player. He's got a high low work rate, so just swing the ball and he'll head it in the back of the net. He was actually quite good last FIFA. And the next one, we've got the god that is team of the season, Carlos Tevez. 88 pace, 94 shooting, and 91 dribble. Cost me 5.3 mil, but Christ, is it going to be worth it? Again, since I've played games with them, some noob has played 34 games and only scored 16 goals, which is just stupid. But Tevez is just absolutely unreal on this game, and I'm sure he's going to score tons for me in the game that we are going to jump into now. And hopefully, absolutely smash another person with another one of our full team of the season teams. Let's see who we are going to give a smashing to today. Oh my God, he's got 46 goals! <laughs> This is divisions as well. This guy is going to get the sausage jumps. I'm predicting a rage quit here, boys. Oh my god. It looks like he's just started FIFA 14. I don't really know what he's doing. Like, 
I would say that maybe someone's gone back to do a retro road to glory or something like that. But it doesn't seem like he knows what he's doing either with his chemistry and stuff, so I've got absolutely no idea what's going on. And hopefully, we're just going to give him the absolute sausage. Oh, he's rage quit. That didn't take long at all, did it? The only thing I can think of is he was doing, like, a squad fitness game or something like that. He just joined the game and then quit straight away to get fitness back for the people on his bench. But then I don't know why he would do that in seasons. So I think he just pussied out because our team is sick. Take two then, let's see if this guy, he's got 100 chemistry, this is good. He's got a pretty decent team actually, he's got David Louise, we all know how sweaty he is, especially on the old games in the BPL with company. Yoyo Torre, Schürrle, Nani, Suarez, which is pretty cool at Liverpool, Rooney, he's got a pretty decent team I think. Might actually get a hard game out of this one. Oh, what a ball, Pogba. Immobile with the fake shot, and oh, what a save by Czech as well. These players are insanely good. I can feel it already. Nice interception, Callihan. Long shot. Why not? Oh, because Czech will just save it. That's why, Andy. Come on. Let's get in and actually score a decent goal before we start titting around. Javinho with the skills to pay the bills. Javinho with the pace to sprint into the box. And tramp it across and score. Oh my god, I'm an awful person. I say this every time when I play one of these games. I'm an awful person. I'm just an awful person in general, but I don't care because I'm winning 1 0. Oh, Vidal with his 80s and everything almost, apart from defending him, but we don't care because he's going on the attack. Has he, got, he hasn't got four star skills. Fucking hell, Andy, you stupid idiot. What's his throw like? Absolutely terrible. Jesus Christ. Tevez. Tevez. Oh my god, the pace on this lad. Go on. He's past Kyle Walker. He's passed them all. No, oh, what a tackle by Vincent Company. You've got to give that to the lad. That was a good tackle. Go on, Immobile. Chip that motherfucker. Yes, into the top corner. I told you this Immobile was good, even though he's only 82 rated. I could have went for Sergi, but I remember that he's just not a very good striker on FIFA 14. Whereas this guy is actually really bloody good. Bangs it out to Javinho. On the volley. Oh, God. How have we not scored? How have we not... Okay, we've scored. We've scored in the end. I don't know how that took four goes to get in. But still, 3-0 after 28 minutes. This team is ridiculous. And like I said, this guy's team's actually good as well. And we're still just giving him the sausage. Like I said as well, this is probably the best one of these team of the season teams so far. Simply because of that three-man midfield. The somehow ridiculously overpoweredness of Immobile and Tevez up front. Oh, Pogba's through. The keeper's out. Pogba's dinked it. It's dropped to Immobile and he's tucked it away. Of course he has. Of course he has. He finishes everything, this kid. Oh, it's all rage quit. I'm having so much fun. What can you expect of this team, boys? It's so good. A hat-trick for Immobile as well is madness. Let's jump in and play another game because I'm really enjoying this. Victim number three, please, is, again, a pretty sweaty... Has anyone got anything apart from a pretty sweaty BPL team? Well, this one's slightly hybridised because he's randomly got Pogba in the middle. He's got Jesus Navas up front, that's pretty sweaty, but to be honest, we should still give him the absolute sausage. Oh, and Mobile playing the 1 2. Has he got the legs on him because he's only got about 82 pace? We'll fake shot back inside. That is a terrible fake shot. Pogba on the edge. He's taking it down dreadfully. Come on, mate. Yes, and Mobile, finish that. Of course he has, boys. He's so fucking good. Yes, Javini. Oh, go on, my son. Use that pace. Past company. Ref, that's a foul. He's just took me out. Oh, he slowed me down so much when I knocked the ball past him. Go on, though, Pogba. Oh, lucky bugger this guy is. Javinho again. Off to De Rossi. Let's go for a screamer. Okay. <laughs> okay, Andy. Less of that. <laughs> Into a mobile. Tandem. Ref. Penalty. Surely. Are you joking? He's given a goal kick, hasn't he? He's given a goal kick. Wow. Immobile is so good though, man. He just spun him and got fouled as he shot and just the game's a little bit shit. Oh, shit. That's such a good pass. Oh, that is cheeky. Oh, why did you just stop instead of getting it? Jesus Christ. That was a cheeky goal. I've got to give that to him. That was pretty good. I don't know what Chiellini was doing, but he ran the wrong side of the post instead of running to the side and getting the ball. Never mind. Oh, come on, Pogba. Of course he's finished it. What a sick goal that was. 
Not gonna lie, I was trying to do a skill move and ended up just shuffle dribbling instead. But it worked, an absolute dream. And what a finish as well that was. Pogba is a beast on this game. Oh no, this guy's playing some sick passes. Good job, I've got a beast of a team of the season defense to take most of them out, apart from that one ridiculously good one. What a ping. Go on, Immobile, run. He hasn't got the legs at all. Bloody company. Yes, go on, Pogba. Go on, Pogba. Team of the season players are so, so good. I cannot wait for the FIFA 15 ones. Oh my God, this Pogba is unreal. Can he get an absolute screamer for a, oh, for a hat-trick? That would have been so good. Well, there we go, boys. Victim number three. It was a little bit of a struggle there, but in the end, we got to fuck him in the ass. And we managed to win 3-1 after their 90 minutes. So there we go. Two rage quits, and this guy got a bit of a sausage, and he never really came close to scoring, to be perfect honest. It just took us a little bit of a while to get Pogba to smash into the back of the net, but he did the business in the end, and we won 3-1. Hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Like I said, if you could smash 5,000 likes in two hours, that would be insane, and I will bring you guys five-star skilled Ibrahimovic as well. So make sure you drop the likes if you would like to see that video. Hope you guys have enjoyed this. Make sure you subscribe if you are new around here. Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.